of us at First Family Church, we wish you all a blessed Thanksgiving. And we keep in our thoughts and prayers all those who are born without and hungry. This year, less fortunate. May God watch over them and bless them. Amen. <clears throat> There's some of the stuff we made today. Cranberries, eggs, fresh homemade polo sausage that we ground up and stuff. Broccoli, cheese, turkey, sweet potato. Some of what's left of my food yet. Stuffing. Rolls. Glass of wine. Glass of milk. Some pumpkin filling for homemade pumpkin pies that we're going to be making. That we took and ground up from pumpkins. And the first time that I've made a pie from scratch, I made a blueberry pie. Uh, I did not make the dough, though, that came from the store. I just used some flour and a rolling pin, and but I did the rest of the work. But uh, it, is, it is homemade for the most part. It's not a pie that was bought. The turkey. What's left of it? Still pretty much pretty good. Yep, indeed. And that's one of the best things. Turkey sandwiches of the day. Turkey fettuccine. Turkey casserole. Turkey soup. Turkey sandwiches. That's always the best thing. On some regular white bread with some butter. Key salt and pepper. Mm-hmm. Yum, yum. What's that? And gravy. Yep, can't forget that. Oh, yes. The polo sausage I'm really proud of. That came out good. Like I said, we stuffed that ourselves. Ground up the meat. Added in all our secret family seasonings that we use. And then stuffed it and froze it. Because we stuffed it about two weeks ago, if that. Froze it and then just thawed it out and then cooked it and it came out really, really good. I'm a fourth generation sausage stuffer. I'm a second generation cheese maker. In the meantime, until we make our pumpkin pie, which we'll do tomorrow because the uh, pumpkin filling that we have is still frozen some. Uh, just bought one from the grocery store, so... And then of course with anything, even with a glass of wine for supper, I always got to have a glass of milk too. I love milk. And also made a salad. And with that, enjoying some television too with a two-day marathon of soap. Old television show from the 1980s. So, with this, we'd like to say, again, Happy Thanksgiving to everybody out there in the world. And may God bless you all. And may God protect and watch over everything that he's ever created. Amen.